You wanna hang out with mommy? Hmm? You wanna hang out with mommy? <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys what's in my bag. Fall edition. This bag is enormous, I know. This is the brand Base. 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 Can't pronounce it, but I'm obsessed with this bag. I did get an ad for it because I've been looking for the perfect tote work bag. Like the perfect tote work bag. So I'm excited to show you guys this bag. I'm obsessed obsessed i mean this brand in general i'm obsessed with and i definitely want to buy more of their products but before we get into it i do want to let you guys know i am a licensed hair professional i do hair in orlando so i do like to carry a lot of stuff here for the salon for work and that way i'm not bringing 20 different bags and i'm also bringing things that i need if you guys are new here definitely subscribe so you can see more videos like this i do like to film lifestyle videos beauty hair anything beauty related so definitely give me a follow. Also, follow my Instagram, Ashluna, down below. Let me know that you're from YouTube. So if you guys are interested to see what's in my work bag, then just continue watching. Also, side note, I do have a new background because I really got tired of staying on top of my bed. And I don't know, I just wanted to switch it up. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this new background. Let me know what you think down below. I It just sucks because my glam room doesn't have a window. It's considered a den and I know in my last apartment I filmed so many videos in my glam room because it was huge. I had a window But unfortunately, there's no window in here So I don't like to film in here at all unless I'm doing a get ready with me in front of my vanity But I just decided to switch it up. I did get this cube shelf not too long ago. So I don't know, it was a little bit more aesthetically pleasing. I also have a studio light behind me to give a little bit more lighting, so side note, but just let me know what you guys think. So to talk about my bag here, it is from the brand Base, Bayus, Base. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, not sure. I will put the actual pronouncing here on the screen, but yeah, I'm terrible at pronouncing things. So I'm obsessed with this bag and this brand. I definitely wanna buy some more products from them because I just love their entire, all of their products, it's amazing. So to start off with the bag, I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna tell you guys the name of the bag because I think this is the work tote bag. I will put a photo on the screen of what my bag is, but it's called the East to West Tote. That's what my bag is. It looks pretty small in the picture, but in person it's huge and I'm just obsessed. It has everything I need in one bag. That's the reason why I got it. I love it so much. Okay, so let's go straight in. We have a bunch of compartments in here. So we have the front little pocket. We also have this huge big um, side pocket in the back. But what's nice about this bag, which is the reason why I bought it, is because there's a zipper underneath here and you can use this as a travel tote and you can put it on your luggage on that little handle there. I do like to use my tote bags that I use for work to travel with as well. Like if I'm going to the airport or like a little weekend getaway because it's just easy for me to keep everything in one bag and not take things out because that's how I lose things and get and forget things when I travel and stuff like that. So that's one of the main reasons why I bought this bag and as well as the laptop slip. There is a little laptop compartment here. Again, I just want to keep everything very simple, throw everything in here, bring it to work, and that is it. Because before, I was bringing my work bag, my tool bag, which I put all my tools in, and as well as my laptop case. I still bring my laptop case here and there if I need to use a lot of things in the case, like hard drives, adapters, and all that. But for the most part, if I'm just going to use my laptop, I'll just throw it in the slip and maybe a charger in there, and that's it. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here, so we're just gonna get right into it. So in the front pocket here, we have a lipstick. This is the Amrezy from Pretty Little Thing. This is in the color Soho, number two. This is one of the darker nudes that she has. I also have the lighter one. I'm obsessed with the collaboration she did with Pretty Little Thing. I have a couple cards. I have two foxtail free coffee. We have a bunch of foxtail here in Orlando. Um, I also have a Visa gift card, need to use this up, and as well as a little note sticky. <laughs> I have a spoolie because my lashes are always looking crazy, so I have a spoolie everywhere in case I need it. 
Um, this is a, what is this? This is just a little parking garage information for a hotel we stayed in Miami. And then I have some cash tip. Sometimes I will accumulate my cash tips in my bag. And then when I'm doing these type of videos or when I'm cleaning out my bags, I will collect them and save them because I do save my cash tips. Put that on the side. And then right inside of the bag, in this little pocket here, I have nothing except another spoolie. <laughs> and then I'm just gonna start taking out random stuff. I have a hairbrush. This is the brush that I like to use on myself when I blow dry. Once in a blue moon, I will use this on a client, but not really, this is my brush. So I like to bring it to work in case I need it, but I do bring it back home on the weekend so I can use it when I blow dry my own hair. I have a parking ticket. I need to pay this today before it goes up. Oh, and there's no, there's no um, paper in here. So did I get a parking ticket or not? I don't know. <laughs> That's weird. I have a fan here that I like to use at work whenever I'm hot or doing a Brazilian blowout because Brazilian blowouts, the chemicals are a little bit intense. So it makes my eyes burn. And this is just really nice to blow the fumes out of my face. And it's just really great for the summertime when I'm walking to my car and I'm extremely hot. <laughs> I really don't need to bring this anymore, but in case I have a Brazilian blowout or I get really, really hot in the salon, this is a must. I have another brush. This is the Epic Professional from Wet Brush. I love to use this for Brazilian blowouts and I am gonna give myself a Brazilian blowout later today. So I did bring it from the salon. Usually I just keep it in my station for clients but I need it for myself today. <laughs> I also have another brush for a Brazilian blowout. I am borrowing this from the salon so I can use this on myself and then I will return it. I have my blow dryer here. This is the Babyless Pro. I think this is a Rapido one, but the Pro one, it has turbo on it. It's amazing. It was $200, best blow dryer I've ever used. I'm not a fan of the Dyson for professional use. It's just constant use. So I love this blow dryer so much. I have another hair tool here. I have my flat iron. This is the Croc flat iron. I love this flat iron so much. I got this back in 2014. Was it 2014? Yeah, I got this back in 2014 and it's going strong. Going strong. Oh, also, I typically don't bring this from work on the weekends, but since I'm doing a Brazilian blow, I needed to bring this. I also have my curling iron. This is from Babyliss. This is the one and a quarter. I use this curling iron on every single client. All different types of hair length unless it's a short bob then i'll use a one inch but for the most part i use one and a quarter on everyone and i do bring this on the weekends just in case i'm going to curl my own hair i do have a curling iron here for my own use but it's not the greatest i like this one better so i like to bring it just in case and that is pretty much it for all of the hair tools anyways now moving on to everything else i have my little emergency pouch that i have shared in my last couple what's in my bag videos i'm not gonna go into depth because it's just the same stuff i have band-aid have some ibuprofen and this little pill holder i have deodorant a scrunchie birth control <laughs> i have tied to go pen a regular pen liquid iv you never know you need to hydrate i have a random makeup remover wipe <laughs> Hand lotion, which I was actually looking for some at the salon the other day. I should have just looked in here. I have roll-on perfume and then my seed probiotic. And that's pretty much it. And then I have a random lipstick in here, which I should probably take that out because it's just supposed to go in my... <gasps> Honey Love! Oh my god! I love this lipstick so much. Wow, okay. I'm going to put this in my lipstick holder. Let's just take out the lipstick pouch. So in here I have, again, all of the lipsticks and lip liners I like to use. I'm not going to go into depth because I have filmed a couple of these videos and I've gone to depth on what's in this little pouch. But it's basically a bunch of nudes. I have an LA Girl lip liner. I have MAC lip gloss. I have NYX lip gloss. And another MAC lipstick. A couple other lip glosses. So I'm going to put my Honey Love lipstick in here. I also have another random pouch in here. There is a hand sanitizer in here. We have polar ice gum. You have popcorn in case I want a little snack at work. A random knife and Advil. 
And then I have another pouch in here. Obviously, I like pouches because this bag is so big. If I just throw a bunch of random stuff in here, I'm going to be digging and it's just a hot mess. So this pouch, I call it my little tech pouch. I have some chargers. I have an Apple Watch charger. Um, what else? A regular iPhone charger. I have some iPhone earplugs. And then some... Oh, do I have cash in here? Oh, I have cash. Oh, I have a couple of dollar bills. And then I have... And this is pretty random. It's eye goggles from when I was using the tanning bed back in my honeymoon. And then that's it. And then there's a random slip in here. Is that my ticket? No. Yeah, random. But yeah, I like to keep all of my cables in here, chargers and stuff like that, etc. I also have my laptop charger in here. I have some acid reflux pills. This is a must when I'm drinking because I have the worst acid reflux. It just helps me not throw up. I love that. I found my ticket and why is the amount $37? I thought it was 27. Wow. I hate the city of Orlando. I have another bill here I need to pay. I have a Target receipt. What is this? Yeah, Target receipt. I have my Tory Burch wallet. I don't use this wallet every single day. I also have my EDC ticket in here. Boop, boop. And I have some more cash that I should put in my little savings. Yeah, keep this in here. I just have all of my important cards in here, but I do use a little thinner wallet for everyday use. I have a portable charger. This is from Anchor. This is the best portable charger ever. It's on Amazon. It's amazing. And this one is the cheaper one. I think this is like $28. Love it. I bring this everywhere. Everyone needs this in their life. Literally everyone. I have a lid for my Tums, which I need to throw away. <laughs> I also have some gum. This is not my favorite gum, but I got this in a little goodie bag for a bachelor I went to, so kept it in my bag. I also have a random body spray from Victoria's Secret. I always keep a body spray in my bag in case I need a little refresh at work. You never know. I have some, I have a Band-Aid. <laughs> I have a Anastasia mirror. I love this mirror whenever I need to apply my lip liner, lipstick at work, or just need to touch up my face. I also have my little feminine bag here where I keep more birth control and tampons. All right. Oh, I have a block charger here. I'm always losing these things, so I need to make sure I don't lose it. What else? And then in the laptop slip, I just have some random nuts, mixed nuts as a snack for work. And then that is pretty much it. This is random. This goes in one of my summer bags. My little summer shoulder bag. So I need to put that back in there. But that is pretty much it. That's what's in my bag. Oh, and a paycheck. I need to get rid of this. Paycheck. And that's it. I do want to show you guys the compartments in here though. Because I'm obsessed with this bag. It holds so much stuff. There's two water bottle sleeves here you can put your water bottle here i love that and then again you have a big zipper and then you have over here you get the laptop slip so i can put my laptop in here i also have more compartments here where i can put a pen maybe some post-it sticky notes and just more things and there's also some straps here you can hook up to have it more of a long messenger shoulder bag and that is pretty much it this bag is freaking amazing it was 110 bucks. I loved it. It's literally perfect. I was so tempted on getting the March Jacob bag because I've been wanting that bag for a long time. I know it's super trending right now, but the reason why I didn't get it is because the material of the bag, I will get it dirty the first day. This material is different. I don't know how to explain it, but it's cleanable. It also has these little things down here to keep everything nice and sturdy. I'm just obsessed with this bag. And at first when I got it, I was like, wow, this bag is huge. It's bigger than me. It's literally huge. <laughs> but Ryan was like, Ashley, you need that bag. You can just hold everything in there. You don't have to carry different bags with you. I'm like, you're right. And I'm obsessed. And I can't wait to travel with this. I've already went to Miami with this bag. And it was just super easy to pop the slip open and just put it through my luggage. It's just amazing. I love this bag so much.
now it's time to organize it and put everything away so that completes my what's in my work bag fall edition hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did definitely let me know down below what you think you guys should definitely check out this brand and not sponsored at all but they have so many amazing products i definitely want to get their luggage because it de-collapsed and you can put it under the bed it's just easy storage wise we live in an apartment we don't have that much storage in here so i just like love the whole concept of this brand it's amazing and i like how sleek and neutral these bags look I'm just obsessed so if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a big thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe down below to help your girl out and i'll see you guys in my next video bye